Hey there friends, it's Nick. This is episode 445 of the Story Hacker podcast. Right, but it's a Sunday, so it's going to be a nice short one. But what I, what I want to do, I want to encourage you, I want to entreat you to do something that you may find uncomfortable. And, um, yesterday in episode 444, I talked about how, how I've got this sort of mini flywheel in my business, which starts with every day sitting down and thinking about something which I would then become part of the podcast as I kind of attempt to better articulate the ideas and the strategies of story and business. And, you know, I talked about how that that simple um, that simple discipline of sitting and thinking every day has really helped me come up with new distinctions and new articulations and a deep it's deepened my understanding. And it's really thinking, thinking that I want you to I want to encourage you to do. Now, it's very likely if you listen to this that you're already doing a lot of reading, and I love reading. I mean, it's it's the it's the gift that that keeps on giving, as far as I'm concerned. But I've also been guilty in the past of just reading the words that other people have written, just thinking the thoughts that other people have had, just espousing the strategies that that other people have espoused without without always and perhaps even without generally giving it the the actual intellectual thought that that it needs to check actually does this make sense is this right does it work how can i test it you know all of those kind of things and i think I think if we're in business, we need to we need to understand what's going on. And one of the things we have at the moment, particularly because there is just so much content everywhere, is a kind of very often a blind acceptance that because someone says this thing will work, this is what I should do. You know, and so much of the <laughs> so much of the internet, in particular. Um, ignores context. Now I've said on this podcast there are you know there are businesses and there are business models where really story doesn't matter or at least it won't it won't make a a big enough difference to matter and it certainly won't um be the first thing you want to try if your business is in trouble story is a long term strategy it's not for everyone okay I want to make that clear but I think thinking is for everyone and it's also hard and it's one of the reasons why perhaps in my uh, 20s and 30s and 40s, I perhaps read more books than I might have, and I thought less than I should have. So that's the, the simple message to me. Try and, if you can, try and carve out at least 10 minutes a day, and maybe you are, and if you are, and you've been doing it for a while, I think you'll have, um, you know, you'll be doing well in your business but try and carve out 10 or 15 minutes a day where you can just sit and think and by all means have a pad of paper have a pen you know I think with a pen in my hand generally but um, the thinking is the thing it's the only way that we can we can really create our own ideas uh, rather than just blindly following other people's thanks for listening and remember your story means business